Hello and welcome back. It's great to see you guys here. So we are here at the Dino Dig and we are here on the map right over here, Dino Dig Oasis. And so this is where we are right now and we are gonna talk to Professor Skoog here. And he says, welcome to Dino Dig Shop. Want to see what I have for sale? And you can go ahead and go to the shop. You need to buy the shovel prior to being able to go and enjoy the Dino Dig. So here at the Dino Dig store, there are a few things to go into. The pets I'll talk about in a specific episode about the pets. And there's also some cool furnitures if you, furniture if you would like to uh, decorate your room in a dinosaur theme. Pretty cool stuff. But I wanted to do this video. Be sure to subscribe. Be sure to like for more tips and tricks, by the way. Uh, let's go ahead and come on into the museum because I have something that I would like to show off that I am pretty proud of I have completed all of the dinosaurs so all of the dinosaurs I have found all of the bones for so we have all of these up and on display I think I'm gonna be coming over here and checking this out uh, pretty often very excited to have finished this off and I kind of wanted to just show this off to you guys now if you are playing prodigy at school Dino Dig is not really something that you get math questions for. So um, as an educator, I never really let my students uh, go here. But at home, it's a great place to go ahead and hang out, have some fun, and do the Dino Dig. So we're going to go and select Dino Dig right now and check it out. Now, as a member, there are, let's, actually, let's go ahead and click How to Play. It says, this game is all about digging up fossils. To find fossils, just click around the dig site to start digging. Your shovel will tell you how close to the fossil you are. Cold means you're far away. Hot means you're close. When you find something, the shovel button will pop up. Keep clicking it to dig up your new find. Once you dig it up, you can start looking for the next item. You have 90 seconds to dig up as many fossils as you can. And if you get uh, three items, then he'll add 15 seconds to it, and that repeats on. So let's go ahead and start. Um, it says the museum is full, so we don't need any fossils. But do you want to dig anyways? It will cost you 200 gold. Prior, it was costing 300 gold to dig, and now we can go ahead and just dig. Uh, since the museum is done, I guess the price has dropped, which is cool. But this is continuing on doing this. I can walk faster or I can dig faster. There was also a member button for getting more fossils. That's what I chose to do. Um, I'm going to walk faster for my option. And if you are a member, each time you play, you do get this option. Let's go ahead and click apply here. And it's going to start digging now. And we have our music back. So ice cold means we're far away. Cold, we're getting closer. Cold, we're getting closer. All right, let's check up here over here. Um, if you are in interested in uh, morph marbles, this is a great way once you have completed your um, uh, your uh, all, all of the different dinosaurs to go ahead and see if you can get some more morph marbles. I tend to get a fair amount of morph marbles in every once in a while misteel, so if you like to go ahead and uh, morph into misteel, then that is something that we can do. So what I'm doing is I'm just trying to create a big grid and checking large areas. So clicking around kind of in a pattern in order to see if I can find the dig sites there. We have a tin can, which um, now I'm getting more of those. So that's ice cold that way. It was cold, so it's probably down over here. Yep, we're getting warmer. Now it's dig, dig, dig. Awesome. And so you kind of want to see which way you want to go if you get ice cold. So he says, Pondurus, since you got so many items, I'll give you another 15 seconds. Thank you, Professor Scoob. And we're cold here. Cold. So let's see if we get warmer. We're warmer. We're cold, so we need to go this way. We're hot. So it's right around here somewhere. And there we are. There's the dig. And then we dig it up. It's a pretty, it's a, it's a very fun, enjoyable game. And it doesn't look like we're really hitting any morph marbles here. So, uh, oh, we're warm. Okay. There we go, we got our dig. It was nice and fast, so let's pull up a morph marble. Oh no, so we're not going to get the morph marble because I am recording, but I swear, I get a lot of morph marbles here. So um, if that is something that you are interested in, we're cold. Um, ice cold, so over this way. And we got the dig place, but we're not going to have time to dig. 
it's a really, really fun mini game in here. And so he's going to show us what we dug. So we got 70 gold coins, uh, not quite what we put in. Um, but if we get a morph marble or two, it's uh, pretty exciting. So, uh, yeah, I let me know how close you are to finishing up your collection. Double check. Make sure that you are subscribed. So for our tips and tricks, you will be getting more of these. This is a really, really fun way. And it was super fun um, uh, getting all of the... Oh, look, we're walking down different ways that's cute um, uh, all of these different uh, skeletons up all of the different animals sort of completed now here for P professor skoog I'm going to be talking about it in another episode but there are a bunch of dinosaur pets that you can go ahead and purchase here some of them you can find around the uh, land and there is even one that is legendary we'll be talking about this pterosaur and some tricks and uh in order to get this pterosaur and not spend twenty thousand gold that'll be in an upcoming video though um so yeah be sure to like be sure to subscribe i will be looking forward to seeing you next time and i'm really happy that i was able to complete the um uh museum and get this awesome suit with the explorer hat which was one of the reward items for completing Completing. And then also we have the digging outfit, which I, I'm digging the digging outfit. It's, it has a heart bonus of six and it's just really cool. It says this is the outfit of the Oasis Institute of Natural Creatures or Oink for shorts. Pigs love that place. Um, and so, yeah, <laughs> be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. I will see you guys next time. This hat is rumored to have been worn by Looter Dan, the Academy's greatest explorer. All right. <laughs> See you next time. Bye-bye.